Hey guys, what's up? It's the Electrical Code Coach here, and this is The Electricians in Action, where we get together and we talk about the code every morning before we go out and fight the good fight. All right, so let's go ahead. We're continuing down this line of showers, tub spaces, where it's allowed, where it's not, and it gets kind of convoluted in the 2020, so let's go ahead and break it down. First, we're going to deal with switches. Let's just get them right out of the way. We're in the 2020 code. We're dealing with switches. It's the same deal. You cannot have um, switches or switches. Let's just deal with switches first. You cannot have any switches. You're going to walk up to the tub. You're going to draw a line, an imaginary line to the ceiling. You're going to draw that line all the way back. And you cannot have a switch inside that zone unless it's a listed part of the tub assembly. And we talked about that yesterday. If you missed yesterday, go back. It's the 2017 version of this. I really encourage you to know both of them and watch how it's evolved. So when we get into the 2023, you're on page and you're sharp. All right, so here's the score. Same, pretty much the same code as the 2017. Draw a line to the ceiling, scoot it back. Can't have a switch inside that zone unless it's part of a listed tub assembly. Now let's get to receptacles in the 2020. And this is kind of where it gets convoluted. And honestly, to me, it could be dangerous. And let's talk about it for a minute. I want your opinion. So here's the score. In the 2020, what you're going to do now is you are going to, you're going to have a zone. And this zone starts at the face of the tub and it includes all the space inside the tub and it extends out three feet past that. So you take the tub, say the tub ends here, and all that zone back there, and we're going to talk about height in a second, all that zone out there, hold on, Bella. She's wanting to get out and get something. So all that zone back there, and three foot out this way in front of the tub, and then you draw an eight-foot line and an eight-foot line over. So anywhere outside of that eight-foot line, meaning that you could put a receptacle up high in the 2020 code, as long as it's over eight feet, which I fundamentally disagree with, and I hope that they change that in the 2020. But all you do is you draw a zone, eight foot high, three foot out away from the tub. You're not allowed to put a receptacle there, which is gonna throw a wrench in a lot of bathroom designs. So here's the edge of the tub, three feet, 36 inches. I can't even have a receptacle at all. And it's like, oh my goodness. And this was a huge fuss when they dropped the 2020 code changes at one of the big meetings. A lot of the, the big wigs were there. And they brought up the fact that what if the bathroom's too small, but I don't remember, and I might have just not been paying attention, they didn't bring up the fact that there's already an exception in the code. So there's already an exception in that code, and what it states is, is if that bathroom is too small, okay, if that bathroom is too small that it encroaches on that three-foot zone, you can still put it in that zone, but it's got to be on the farthest wall away from the tub, which also could uh, you know cause lots of problems as far as designing goes so if you're if your bathroom's too small and it's no more than three foot away you can put it in but it's got to be in that wall that is farthest away from the shower so if your door swings that way because you can't put it behind you we learned the other day where you can and can't put it in the other video that we dropped recently so it's just one of those things guys that it's going to become tough on where you know where you can put it but what I, what doesn't make sense to me is that you can get you can put it in the tub or shower space as long as it's eight foot high. So that doesn't make any sense to me. I want to hear what you guys think in the comments below. How dangerous would it be? Somebody's going to push that to the limit. Okay, be like, okay, I can't put it out there. I'll put it up eight foot high. Now, it would not count as the one within three feet like we learned the other day, but I want to get your guys' comments on this. So in the 2020, same thing as the switches. You draw a line to the ceiling all the way back. Can't put a switch unless it's part of the listed tub assembly. In the 2020, as far as receptacles, you're going to you're going to take eight foot high and three foot out from the face of the tub of the shower and all of that zone. You cannot put a receptacle, but you can put one anywhere out of it. If your bathroom is smaller than three foot, you know, from the tub face, you could put one within that zone, but it has to be on the farthest wall in that room.